Hi and welcome to the Ideal Calibrations How to Bump Test Monitor Series. So we've got the Altair 5 and it's already in normal reading mode, which is essentially you just start the monitor up and do the pump check and then let it get to this screen here. And we also have a cylinder of calibration gas with a demand flow regulator attached, which is really just a regulator that when there's vacuum on this end here, it opens up the valve to allow the gas to flow, which is what we use for a pump monitor like the Altair 5. To do a bump check, all we're really checking for is to make sure, number one, that the sensors are working. We're not really looking at how accurate they are. We also want to make sure that the strobes are working properly, the vibrating alarm is functioning properly, and that the horn is loud enough that we can hear it clearly. Okay, to do the bump test, it's really quick and easy. Leave the monitor running. Put the gas on. And we're really just watching to make sure that all of the sensors start moving, which you can see all of them are moving upward and oxygen's moving down and all of our alarms are going off. I can feel the vibrating alarm, I see my strobes, and I can hear the horn going off. And that's it. That's all it is for a bump test. We can take our gas off. And now we go to our bump test sheet, and we can turn the alarms off by hitting this button here on the right. Do an alarm reset. But now we would go to our sheet, record that we have successfully bumped the, all of the sensors, so we would check for each sensor, as well as to check that all of the alarms went off. And then we would record lot number of the calibration gas so we have that for our records you can find the lot number and the expiration right here on the line okay thank you much for watching and stay safe out there